Lastly, Sean, just uh, Fury Usek. That's the fight people are going to be thinking of now. Remember, of course, you fought Usek, because yeah. everyone knows <laughs> the yeah. amateurs. How yeah. would that fight go, you think, man? Is it two skilled guys and the bigger skilled guy beats the smaller skilled guy kind of fight? Or what do you think, Sean? Usyk can beat him to the punch. He did have problems with Valim, who's a southpaw. Tyson Fury has to be in shape for Usyk. I got a feeling, I don't even really like using that term in shape. He's got to be in supreme condition in order to fight Usyk. That's not a five or six round fight. I don't care how big you think. Tyson Fury is. It's not a five or six round fight because Usyk knows how to roll off his shots. Usyk knows how to use his feet. Usyk knows the, how to how to grab and, and and clinch and things like that. Everything that um a lot of the things that Deontay needs and needed in this fight, Usyk can do all of those things. So this is not a five or six round fight. It goes into the later rounds. I think it goes the distance, and I do think that um that that could be the fight where we see um. The fight that uh, Anthony Joshua versus Alexander Usyk, it was a really good boxing match. Tyson Fury ver versus Alexander Usyk is a fantastic boxing match. X's and O's, chess match, uh, game plan, all that. I mean, like that's it's one of those fights you see it all unfold right in front of your eyes. You don't count out the Ukrainian, I see. No, I don't. <laughs> I don't. Thank you, Sean. I know who I was in the ring with. <laughs>